Don't cross dressing when playing online games. Author Agam Mora. Cross dress small world, part 5, moving house. Then, you will start moving to me tomorrow. Dash Dustin messaged me. I texted back, yes. At this time, the team chat box appears a series of messages. Iron Thor, aha, the young couple are flirting to each other in front of the two of us singles. Lost World, hey. Don't disturb their feelings. Baby Love 123, me, tag Lost World if you want to advise him, at least, you should send him a private message. Iron Thor, he did it on purpose. Kill the Liar 8x, have you finished dividing items but already talking like that? Iron Thor, done, boss. This time, my sister-in-law contributed the most, so she got the most items. Baby Love 123, me, who is your sister-in-law? Kill the Liar 8x, once done, disband. It's too late now, let Baby Love 123 sleep. She still has to go to work early tomorrow. Iron Thor, oh, you two live together or what but you know my sister-in-law has to go to work so early tomorrow? Anyway, I'm out of here. See you later. Iron Thor has exited the game. Just a few seconds later, Lost World also exited the game, now only me and Dustin are left. Through the conversation, it can be seen that Iron Thor is a carefree guy, very good at mouthing, while Lost World is more quiet. I doubt, could the three of them know each other outside? Before I join the party, the three of them played together. I heard, I'm taking the place of a retired player. I asked Dustin, did the three of you know each other outside? Dustin replied, then you will know. Go to bed early, I'll pick you up early tomorrow. I said, yes. So I'm out of here. I quit the game, then shut down. As I stood up from the chair and was about to go to sleep, I remembered that I was still wearing Tiffany's outfit. Unexpectedly, after a while, I forgot that I was wearing a woman's outfit. I changed back into my clothes before going to bed. Tiffany's outfit are really comfortable, but when I wear them on the bed, I find it a bit difficult to sleep. I fell asleep after a tumultuous day. I woke up very early. This is probably the first time I wake up so early on my own. You know, you can't expect a neat guy like me to wake up on time. Maybe it was because I slept earlier than usual yesterday, maybe it was because I felt a little eager. It's not that I'm eager to meet Dustin. It's just that I feel a strange feeling before a big change. After having breakfast, when Dustin's car arrived, I said goodbye to my parents and left the house. I approached Dustin's car, Tiffin greeted me from the back seat. When he saw me outside the car door, Dustin said, Hi. You don't bring any belongings with you? You have to stay at my house for a year. I shrugged and replied, Nope. A neat guy like me, besides a computer, there is nothing else. If I do, just bring a few clothes to change. But that's probably not necessary, I know what I am going to wear next. Dustin smiled and nodded, yes. I just asked my father to take a day off today, so I can't take you to buy the necessary things. Dustin started the car. I was about to sit in the back seat when both Dustin and Tiffany told me to get in the co-driver's seat. I had to agree. Somewhere along the way, I realized, we were going to a different place from yesterday's coffee shop. Seeing my confusion, Dustin replied, Ah, my house is in the capital city, near the family company. Yesterday's coffee shop was just a convenience purchase, because it is fully furnished. I feel jealous of profligate rich guys. It doesn't make up for the poor guy to play tricks like me. It only took about half an hour, we reached the capital city. The distance from my house to the capital city is much closer than the coffee shop location yesterday. First, Dustin drove us to stop at a fashion store. 
He asked Tiffany to come buy clothes with me, and he waited outside the car. I blushed when Tiffany tried on women's lingerie and dresses on me. Don't forget, I'm still in the form of a man right now. Fortunately, the store wasn't too crowded, and the store staff didn't care much about it. This is also the first time I have had the opportunity to meet and know so many types of women's outfit. Tiffany even bought me nightgowns, I wonder what this is for. Tiffany told me, I would soon know their benefits. I nodded in agreement. Next, Tiffany led me through the cosmetics counter and introduced me to each item. Even though I only had to do this for a year, I still wanted to put my heart into it. I tried to memorize all of Tiffany's instructions. Next, we went shopping together to buy the necessary personal items for me, all of which were feminine in trend. I kept saying that I would return money for these items to Dustin one day, but he just saw it as a small matter and told me not to be too mindful. We arrived at Dustin's apartment at midday. Normally, Dustin is not with his family. He only returned to the main villa when he needed to have family meetings. Dustin helped me organize all my purchased items, while Tiffany led me to another room. She started doing my makeup. This time, she carefully guided the steps of makeup. Later, I will have to do these things myself, so I listened very attentively. Then, from the bag of clothes she just bought, she took out a lingerie set and a street dress. Since I have experience in wearing women's outfit, this time I changed my clothes without Tiffany's help. After taking off all my men's clothes, I held the lingerie set in my hand and looked at it for a while. This is a very soft white lace lingerie set with a very pretty ruffle design. The reason I looked at it for a long time was because I was the one who chose this lingerie set when I was shopping. Yes, I fell in love with it from the moment I saw it. Because I like this lingerie set so much, I especially bought two sets with two different colors of white and black. By this time, I have learned to accept the situation. I will have to face the status of a girl within the next year. So there's no denying that I love women's outfits. I slip my thin silk lace panties over my legs and pull them up. The moment my panties touched my skin, my heart swelled with joy. Women's lingerie has completely broken my sanity so far. Thanks to them, I realized one thing, that an accessory worn on the body can bring such a strong attraction. Next, I put on my bra and fixed it on my chest. Tiffany didn't expect me to be able to easily fasten the bra hook on the back after only trying it on once. How embarrassing. She didn't know what happened last night at my home, I took the outfit she gave me and put it on again. I looked at my body again in the mirror. I didn't expect that my slim figure that was still sullen now would look so perfect in women's lingerie. I continued to wear the street dress. This is a white, square neck, fishtail dress designed in Korean style. The comfortable cotton fabric and tight fit of the dress accentuate my perfect figure once again. Tiffany also had to admire me. Tiffany started to teach me how to do my hair. She showed me the basics and then recommended that I learn how to do more hairstyles on a beauty website. She emphasized that hair is a girl's background so I need to pay special attention. She let my hair down and applied a herbal remedy to make it smooth and bouncy. Completing the whole process, we appear before Dustin. He was waiting for us on the sofa in the living room. When he saw me come out, Dustin stood still for a while. I felt very worried when I saw Dustin's expression. Am I too ugly? Not suitable for Dustin's eyes? But in just a moment, Dustin broke my thoughts with a smile. Dustin said, You are so beautiful. You're the most beautiful girl I've ever met. My face flushed red, mixed with shame and a feeling of joy at being praised. Dustin continued, So are you ready to be my girlfriend? I nodded, softly replied, Yes, my dear. To be continued.
Today's story would like to stop here. Thank you for watching. Please like and share for people with similar interests to motivate me to develop my channel. Goodbye and see you in another story.